Whether it's finessing a hyzer flip shot down a tunnel, racing your roller to curl up by the pin, or bombing a power hyzer down an open fairway, a distance shot is a thing of beauty. In order to maximize the distance potential in your game, your disc selection needs to be as precise as the shots you throw. To successfully build a bag, you need to tailor it to your individual game. Whether you have a cannon for an arm or throw a smooth controlled 300 feet, the disc needs to amplify what you do well. I want to give you some of my shortcuts to find ideal drivers and suggest a couple of my favorites along the way. Fairway drivers are the workhorses of a balanced and effective arsenal. They're a step up aerodynamically from a mid-range with a pointier edge and a larger rim, so you can easily use a power grip which allows for a greater energy transfer from your body to the disc during the throw. Fairway drivers range from speed six to eight, which means that you'll get a fuller flight out of the disc without sacrificing accuracy. Probably the easiest disc to pick up and throw in the history of disc golf, the Leopard. Because of its smaller rim design, it's easy to grip comfortably, making it a great candidate for your first disc. This disc offers tremendous glide and doesn't require much power to add distance to your game. When you need a driver for those dead straight tunnel splitting shots with a predictable and controllable fade, look no further than the T-Bird. Found in professional and amateur bags alike, the T-Bird is the most trusted and reliable fairway driver in the game. When I take my bag and select the disc for my bag, the driver slightly change. I uh, like to move on to the distance uh, drivers. As we begin to talk about distance drivers, let's address a common misconception, which is that a faster disc automatically flies further. To be most accurate with longer shots, you must select a disc with a speed rating that you can handle consistently. Remember that a disc that glides slowly to the ground will travel forward as it loses speed, whereas a disc that's stalled out will tend to fall off sideways. With that being said, let's talk about smaller rim distance drivers that will add distance potential to your game while still remaining easy to grip. Most amateur players will find their maximum effective distance in this category. Like the name implies, the Rotor Runner makes a great roller disc. You can also power it down for those easy gliding Anheuser shots. Because of the tremendous glide, newer players will find this disc to be great for distance shots. A disc doesn't have to be warp speed to fly far. Want proof? The Valkyrie was a disc that Kristen Sandstrom used to set the world record, a throw of 820 feet a record that stood for 10 years even after faster discs were developed and marketed. What makes this disc so popular is the high utility factor. For most players, the stability is in the sweet spot, allowing them to execute a variety of shots with a single disc. The Wraith is a Speed 11 driver that has a distinct advantage over discs we discussed so far, wind resistance. The Wraith excels at distance in conditions where the wind might flip over understable driver and carry it off target. This disc is great for distance S-curves, turning slightly to get extra distance, and then fading back to a neutral finish to keep you in the center of the fairway off the tee. Okay, let's bring out the big guns. Wide-rimmed, high-speed drivers. They have the most distance potential of all discs, and it's easy to see why. However, to achieve maximum flight with these discs, you need to be able to throw with more velocity. The downside of these discs is that they're less forgiving if not thrown with the proper nose angle and speed. One of the newest additions to the end of a lineup is the turn. In the new Jolly Launcher plastic, it takes controllable distance to a whole new level. When you're ready to step up to a speed 12 driver, the turn should be the first one you try. With a great combination of glide and neutral stability, it forgives most release errors. And when you release with a slight hyzer, it pops a flat carrying you to new lengths off the tee. Slicing through the air at speed 13, the Katana cuts wide distance S-curves, making it an optimum open field driver. Due to its large turn radius, it excels in tailwinds and calm conditions. Katana, one of the fastest drivers in the game, speed 13. 
the champion, the star. Yeah, I hope I find all these. The Katana will deliver maximum distance, but it requires precise release and perfect timing to master. Just as no two players have the same exact golf game, no two players need to have the same exact bag. From time to time, I'll post more pointers to supplement the foundation that we built. So keep it locked to Spin TV. Now that I've given you the tools, build your bag and hit the course.